Here we are celebrating the new Untouchables anniversary party in London. Let's take a peek at the 21st century modernist and underground 60s scene to see just why this cool and fascinating lifestyle and culture is still as hip as ever. One, two, four! So why is modern 60s culture still relevant today? The, the 60s was such a... Um... Uh, prolific period for music, design and culture. You can never get bored of it. So Rob, uh, tell me about the new Untouchables. What are they about? When did it start? Uh, well, it started in 1997 and uh, essentially it's an organisation that promotes uh, mod culture and uh, underground 60s culture. Boogaloo! You know what to do now. So uh, what's your favourite event, uh, what's your favourite club of the new Untouchables and why? I guess club-wise probably the Mousetrap because it's been running 20 years. Mousetrap is probably a favourite of mine. Do you like Mousetrap? Do you go to Mousetrap a lot? Yeah, go to Mousetrap a lot. <laughs> probably club, oh definitely Mousetrap, yeah definitely yeah. Um, the Mousetrap's always good because it's this is sort of a real roots club and the downstairs vibe, I mean you know, it's about as yeah, underground as you're going to get. When did you get into the mod scene and why? Summer of 79 was brought to my attention. The latter part of that year, I was still quite young then, I got into the two tone ska revival, the Rude Boy thing, and that was the start of it for me. I've known Rob since, you know, mid 80s. My wife's known him even longer, you know, we've all been friends for a long time. The fact that you promote clubs is just a bonus. But we're all a big group of friends that have known each other for over 20, 25 years. Yeah, the New Untouchables was one of the sort of clubs that I was going to go to. I went with a friend of mine from back home, and yeah, from then on, every other weekend, getting, going out and dancing, staying up late. My name's Nat, and I play the organ. My name's Trev, I play the guitar. My name's Des, I play the drums. My name's Sky, I play the bass. You can meet people from all over the world in the same you can, you can look at their different threads. The country, uh, skin, and, and mob. You can get all of those under one umbrella. <laughs> the Untouchables, new Untouchables umbrella. We did the first uh, first ever UK show, or first ever show outside America, in fact, for the Sonics, um, the Undertones, Eli Paperboy Reed. Uh, of course, the Stax guys, which is uh, Steve Cropper, Duck Dunn, and uh, Eddie Floyd. I mean, we've done events in um, Los Angeles and San Francisco. I mean, I've travelled personally to DJ in Japan and places like that, which is an amazing experience. But I think we've, you know, now with the internet and technology and what have you and cheap travel, it's far easier for the guys from Japan or all around Europe, for example, to come to London for the Beat Bespoke or for us to go to Spain for an event. Daddy too. Wow, now that was fun. If you want to keep up to speed on hip scene happenings and grab yourself a piece of the action, go to newuntouchables.com.